Hi, this is Mike, and I'm going to do a quick demo on the um, events tab about the operative set. So you'll notice um, that there's this checkbox, show only operative set, available on the in most of the tabs in the events tab group. So I'm going to jump over here to threads. Let me click on that. There we go. And what I'm going to do is... I would like to focus on just this thread, the event queue. So I'm going to go ahead and select that, and I'm going to right click it, and you'll notice here I have in this pop-up menu I have an option for operative set, and I'm going to say add uh, that selection. So what that does is it allows me to check this box, and so then instead of showing all the possible events, for a recording, I can focus on one thing. So now when I check that box, only the events related to the event queue show up. So let me jump back to the overview tab, and you can see here I've got a lot of events. If I check that box, I've got 61,000 here to start. By turning that on, I only see 13,000 events there. And let's see that we see we have a lot of, you know, uh, count the high count here for a lot of different stuff. Let's go ahead and check that and that gra uh, that pie chart chains quite quite a bit too. So you can see that the operative set um, setting that allows you to change the um, the focus of what you're looking at uh, when you're looking through your events and stuff uh, just with that little setting. I can of course uncheck all these. And also, um, to get back to my default settings, I can always um, select something here. And then when I go to operative set, I can just to choose clear. And then that sets it back to the uh, default settings. So um, it's a pretty powerful thing, actually. And you can probably do a lot more with it than I'm showing here. But uh, definitely something to check out uh, the operative set.